What's going on, guys? Jada Black here. Shout out to everyone that's tuning in. I want to talk about Trevon Diggs. Trevon Diggs got with a Instagram model, got pregnant, got her pregnant, and she had a kid with him. And apparently, he's been ignoring her. He has not been doing anything. Now, this is according to her. This is according to her, Yasmin Lopez. She was on a, I believe, a podcast. And this is this is probably what the second or third time. She has publicly outed this guy for not doing anything for her child. Not understanding that I feel like Trevon may, in his mind, believe he made a mistake. And he doesn't want to give her what she wants. Now, does that mean he shouldn't be there for his child? No. Uh, I would hope that he has had a DNA test and that it's been confirmed. I just want to put that out there. because A lot of times these guys may have doubts. But if I'm wrong, it is what it is. But Trevon seemingly isn't doing anything. This is according to her, and she has put him on blast multiple times for ignoring her, the child, not doing anything for them. See, this is why I say that a lot of these athletes, and I would say this to anybody, you need to be extremely careful who you have children by. Because if you have a child by a woman that you don't want, this is the kind of situation you're going to find yourself in you're going to find yourself with somebody that you don't want to wife up that you don't think is wife material well you need to make sure that you're having protected relations with them and not unprotected relations with them when a child can be conceived you have to be careful because just because these women look good on the outside does not mean that they're going to be worthy of a relationship or anything long term but it appears to be a situation where she is just unhappy and she has continuously, continuously going after him. And he has continuously, continuously ignored her. So let's get to this uh, awesome side action article real quick. Football season right around the season is right around the corner. But first, more off the field drama uh, the Cowboys defensive the defense improved drastically last season and large due to second-year cornerback Trevon Diggs, 11 interceptions. Diggs is hoping for another successful season. Unfortunately, his off-the-field drama is once again resurfacing. Instagram model Yasmin Lopez says the NFL player Trevon Diggs pays her no child support. She just wants him to be there in their son's life. Now, I don't know if she has a child support order out on him. I don't believe she does. I could be mistaken on that. But once again, what did you think was going to happen? What did you think was going to happen when you had a child with this guy? Did you think that he would want to be in a relationship with you? That he would want, you know, that, that he would fund your lifestyle, that he would take you with him on trips, that he'd be that baby mama that he keeps close to him and that just hasn't happened. But let's see what she had to say here. You're honestly like, you're a really good mom, but I mean, shit, he's not even, you know, doing, taking care of you for child support and stuff like that. It's like you, but I think you to do it on your own. Like, like me, like mm -hmm. I had a baby for the bag and okay, right. I'm the bag. I'm right. Myself. So yeah. uh, See, I, I don't know what broke shit. bitches. I don't know what y'all thought yeah. the fuck going on around hot tea, but uh, yeah, <laughs> the bag is in her. The she don't gotta be in her bag. And to be honest, I'm gonna have my money to him. So like, I seriously doubt that um, <laughs> once Trevon gets that extension, we'll see about the money thing. But again, if you got if you doing good out here, then why are you asking him for support? Is it about that or is it the fact that you want to be in his life and he doesn't want you in his life? Because that's what I, I'm, I'm seeing from this. I'm seeing that it's a situation where he doesn't want you in his life. He wants you away from him. OK, this is why you, again, don't think because you have a baby by one of these athletes that these guys are going to want you around. Uh, no, because there's plenty of women like you. There's nothing that stands out to you, stands out to him about you that he doesn't see in other these other Instagram models. There's nothing special you've presented. Uh, just the fact that you have a child with him. Let Not me. in the NFL. Wait, is he in the NFL? He's in the NFL, yeah. 
uh, you can you know she doesn't watch it because <laughs> Javon is gonna have a big payday soon probably uh, you know so again if you're flexing if you're flexing financially then why are you asking him for support then because it's not about that you just want to be in his life he doesn't want you in his life and you're using that child as a as a as a means to get him to be in your life and he recognizes that and he doesn't want to be around you period because of that now she will now there were people in the comment section that has something to say to her someone says i love you you know this but trevon did is gonna get paid in the next few years she responded by saying i don't care about the money being in his son's life is more important to me and then they responded he definitely should be in his life but we don't know you know these women everything is one-sided you know trevon is not on social media he's privated his page he doesn't have any posts up like he's pretty much gone from social media because he's tired of these women this is the second woman that he has dealt with that has put him on blast before Yasmin has done this numerous times. These women can't let this guy go. Okay. Yasmin, you had a child with this guy. You know, it takes two to make a child. It wasn't just him and it wasn't just you. It was a both of you. So you have to do whatever it takes to make sure that you're handling your responsibility and that he's handling his. But running to social media is not going to help anything because he's not on social media. So he's not really looking at the comments. He's not really gauging what people are saying because he's not really on it like that. This is why it's easy for him to ignore you and not say anything to you. And then she's flexing about her money and how much she has and how she's going to have more. Yeah, that's 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 that helps your argument. That helps your argument a ton when you can talk about how much money you have or you're, what you're going to be getting. But what you have to understand is you have to be careful of the type of men that you lay down with and have children with, because a lot of those guys may not want to be there long term. And you as a woman, you're bringing this, these types of energies into your life. And you have to know that at some point you're going to want to be with somebody that wants to be with you. Clearly, this was all physical. There was no feelings there. That's why it was easy for him to move on. And she hasn't moved on. This is why she's on social media doing these podcasts, talking about how, you know, she doesn't need anything from. Well, well, obviously you must have needed something from him because you're on social media complaining. Yasmin got pregnant after a summer fling and Trey cut her off shortly after. She refuses to put him on child support and just wants him to be in his son's life. I mean, that seems simple, right? But you got to understand, it's not as simple as she's making it. You know, you have women who will have a child by a guy. And what they will do is they will keep that child out of that man's life because he doesn't want to be with her. I've seen women do this. I'm pretty sure y'all have seen women do this. They will have a child by a guy. And then they won't allow that, that, that man to, to really be a father to that child unless he's doing something for her. Now, according to Yasmin, she doesn't need the money. Okay, so why would he just be ignoring you like this? And it's not because he's just doing it because he just hates the child. Or, you know, it's. It, I believe it's because she's not being 100% honest. Now, she may claim that she is, but I, I'm not seeing it because it's all one-sided. It's all one-sided. Maybe he believes that it was a mistake, baby. And that's why he's cutting off all ties with you. And you sense that and you want to run to the court of public opinion to shame him into being the dad that you claim you need him to be. But here's where accountability comes into play, because you have to be smart and make sure that if you're going to have relations with the guy that has not offered you any type of security as far as a relationship or marriage, that you can't be having children with them because these guys may not want to be with you like that. And you have to read that and understand that. But a lot of times, a lot of these women, they're not going to do that. They're going to get with these guys, have unprotected relations with them. And then when the child is here, now all of us, the ramifications are known, but you have to know this stuff 
before you end up settling into a you know a situation ship with a guy that doesn't even want to be with you like that and it's clear to me that this guy is keeping his distance but i'm not going to sit here and act like this guy is the bad guy and that he's doing it out of spite when we don't know the truth obviously there is a reason why he's keeping his distance and he's just not going public because that's just not who he is he's not he's not the type to put things out there publicly so he's just going to be tight-lipped about it and just not say anything which he you know he has every right to do if he doesn't want to say anything publicly he doesn't have to but she'll do all the talking so let me stay in the comment section below let me know your thoughts like this video and share it follow me on facebook twitter and instagram i'll see y'all next one